Hello and welcome to this video. In this we'll show how to build a script to log in, get an entry from the user form and log out all this while using JWT token and Remedy REST API. Let's start out with a blank text file and let's build a server viral and let's point that out to a particular server. including the port. And now we'll build a post request to that server. And let's add to that uh, initial path API. And let's add a content type as application x triple w form URL encoded. And after that, we'll add a black line, num line number four. And finally, username. And we'll start with that. We'll execute java minus jar, test HTTP client, and our script. And debug HTTP to get evidence on the console. And we notice that uh, there's a post message, including username and password. And then I get a 200 response with a token. Now, in order to reuse that token, I'm going to mark the end of the request on text. And after that, I'm going to say, I need a variable named token with the value AR slash JWT, a space, and then response text. And this will store in the variable token all this text, ARJWT, and all the token that we got as part of the response text of the previous request. And now we're going to the next request. So in that, we'll do a get from the serum server, sorry, and we'll go into API, that's 15 digits to get the entry ID number one, which corresponds to demo. And then we'll use a header called authorization. And we'll use the variable token. And we'll mark the end of that request. We'll save it and see the difference. So now, after getting the token, we're doing a get to this, and we're getting a 404 node found. Let's see what happened. Go oh, on. Yeah, it's a singular entry. So say that, clear the console, trying again, and instead of a 404, we're getting a 200, and those are the values for that demo user. We can see it logging email address, etc., etc. Good. Now let's try to log out. We still need to do a post. Server. We'll use exactly the same authorization header. And instead of posting to API JWT logging, we're going to do log out. And this is console, and let's execute again. So let's review. We did a post to logging username and password. We got the token back. We're making a get to get the user information. We get a 200 and the data from that user. And eventually we'll do the post to logout, and we get a 
204, which means that everything is fine and we have just logged out that user. And this is a script, 13 lines, and you can run it as many times as you want. Thank you for your time.